Hi everyone, welcome to another video. So today I'm going to talk about my own starry universe and I'm just going to talk more about it. This video is not scripted or anything like that so there is going to be plenty of uh, what's the word? Plenty of pauses and plenty of you know cuts here and there so I'm really sorry about this. It's just the idea. I just got the idea right now. And, I, okay, I had no idea what I was going to make for today's video. So, I just thought of this and here we go. Let's begin this video. And if you guys hear, if you guys hear ruffling, it's just me opening this Oreo packet and eating some Oreos. I'm feeling really weak right now, so I just, I, I don't want to freaking feel terrible making this video, so I have to eat something, and so don't mind this in the background, uh, don't mind me, just, ah, uh. so, let's begin, now, when it comes to my own story universe, I would be presenting the star, each story in different formats, by formats, I mean, the four formats, such as comic, sh like normal animation, animated shows, uh, video game, and visual novel. These are the four formats I will be presenting my shows in. Now, these are the only four formats I love to use because it's awesome, I guess. Like, for instance, visual novels, there's choices in the story, there's... There's a lot, a lot happening. You can, it's playable. You know, it's very playable. Comics is something that is also very cool. I can't really remember the time I actually drew a comic, but it was a long time ago, and it was for something that I, I was working on. A, a show, pretty much. But yeah, I, I did work on comics for a while. I was really terrible at them, mostly because getting the frames of the comics were really, just really, 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 really problematic. But, you know, I'm now better at drawing, so I know comics will be much, my comics will be much better looking. I do plan on making plenty of comics, some horror comics, some, you know, funny comics, just, you know, cool comics altogether. I also plan on making video games, but I'm not a, a programmer, but one day when I earn some money, I would make a small video game team to develop some games for some stories, because I have some wonderful ideas for some games, wonderful, wonderful games that could be made. All I just need is some programmers. So one day when I build the story universe up, I get a lot of money, I will work on the video games. And the video games will be really cool. They will be really awesome to play. Uh, they'll be available PC, you know, console, those things. They would be really cheap too. I don't plan on making them really expensive because for once, like, like even for the first ever game, I would, you know, push out there like, Let's just say I create a video game. I get a small team, we create a video game together, and, you know, it's our first video game. I don't want to price it high too much, because it's just our first video game. I don't know how it will go, so it's best to keep it in a minimum price. Some games could be expensive, but that depends on how good it is and, and how much people like it. Uh, but other than that, I don't really care of making games so expensive. Finally is animated shows, which I will be working on a lot. Now, there's plenty of animated shows I would work on. I have so many ideas. All I have to do is just make them. <laughs> That's it. So many ideas. I've been working on the stories for so long. You know, I'm really excited to just work on this. Now, let's talk about target audience. As you guys know, I don't plan on adding my target audience for the woke, for the woke people, because for once, the, like, 
no matter how much you pander to them. Okay, here's the reasons why. For for once, I don't care about po work politics and all that stuff. I don't I don't lean their direction, so I'm not gonna care about their 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 problems. Their problems in quotations. Second reason is you can't please these people. Like, look at Gillette. Look at them. They freaking was saying, you know, bash they were bashing men earlier on and trying to pander to this woke crowd. They lose 8 billion. <laughs> They're not... These type of people, like, the woke, like, look, I don't care about your politics. If, you, if you're if you an SJW, if you, if you want this and that, if you complain about representation and stuff, then my shows aren't for you. You're not my really target, not my target audience, in a way, so that's what I'm trying to say. I know for a fact my target audience will be teens and adults because some of, some of the shows, some of the games, visual novels, comics, are really, 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 like, let's just say they have, it's, it's, how do I say, it's not really for kids in a way because some of them have some adult stuff, some of them have adult jokes, and it's just not really for kids, so it's not safe for them in a way. <laughs> so I just need to put that out there. That's it. That's what, what I was going to talk about. It's just this fascination that I have of making my own shows and my own story universe and presenting it out to millions, well, millions in quotations. I don't think I will reach millions. I'm pretty sure I will reach like less than 100k, but it's totally worth push putting it out there. Now, last night I watched a video called The Evolution of Porky Pig. It was on my recommendations and it was a 24 hour 24 minute video. Um uh, I will leave a link to that. I might leave a link to that if I don't forget. Uh it's just a video on how that how Pocky Pig was created and how he evolved into what we see today in this new version of Looney Tunes. So, like, I'm a fan of Looney Tunes, and like, it's just when I see these old animations, these old stuff, this like the old days of of animation, it just makes me so excited, you know, because it's like these days, it's. The styles, everything is not that cool, I guess. And as I was saying, when you look at these old animations, the old methods, back in the day, the old styles and stuff, you know, you see you see the evolution of old characters and it's like animation is such a wonderful thing. And and I don't know what to say, honestly. These days, all of the animations, I'm not really a big fan of them, to be honest. I just don't really like the styles of them anymore. Thank you guys so much for watching this amazing video. Uh, I would love to talk about animations every day. But unfortunately, I have gaming videos to do. <laughs> I know, right? I have to I have to play gaming videos. I have to make gaming videos. Oh, boohoo, my life sucks. But anyway, I really... Okay, enough joking around. Uh, I would love to know your guys' thoughts. You guys' thoughts on animation. Uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. Bye.